Guys, what's up? I'm going to show you how to get your MacBook here or your Mac onto an Apple TV without getting a black bezel around the edge of your, sorry, at the end of your um, TVs. So this is my Apple TV. As you can see, it's switched on. I do have a PlayStation monitor 3D display. It is a 22 inch. And sometimes when I go into my um, using my Mac as an AirPlay, like going on the internet, it's not very, uh, the, the viewing is not very pleasant because I want it as full screen as possible, but sometimes it don't. But I found the solution out. What you have to do is um, go to your settings, go straight to um, yeah, audio and video, and you wanna go straight to where it says, um, let me just uh, adjust for um, AirPlay over scan. Uh, this is off at the moment and that's what it's got to be if it's always on I'm going to show you when it's off. So this is off. So this is the full screen I'm just going to put my MacBook on um, Sorry, MacBook here and I'm going to actually um, Display it to my TV. I don't know why it's done that. Um, here we go. We are connected So this is my Apple TV um, My MacBook here going to there as you can see it's full screen there's no um, black bezel around the edges where the you know where it can't actually do the resolution, but it does because so, this is my full screen. Um, when I press go back, so I'm just going to pick my remote up and go back, and I'm going to turn the settings on. So when this settings on, it will make your display. I don't know if you can probably see it because my TV is black all around. So. I'm just going to go out and pull TV, um, put my Mac onto the uh, display of my uh, monitor. You probably can't see it, but I'm going to try and do pretty zoom in if you can see it. I, right now, you can actually see the black bezel goes all the way down, straight all the way down. As you can see there, up to 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 there. So yeah, that is the black bezel that I've always complained about, and this is the thing to fix it. So. I'm going to turn this off and I'm going to see if I can do that again when it's off. So it's off right now. I'm going to go on to my um, Apple TV and put my finger on. As you can see, let me just try and focus on here. You can't see nothing. This is just the bezel of the TV. This is not the screen itself, but that's the shrink screen. So it all fix the whole screen. And this is, by the way, a 22 inch. I probably said that in the um, first half of the video, but yeah, it's a 22 inch and it works with anything. So I'm just gonna put in, um, let's put in Netflix uh, to watch some films. Cause I like watching Netflix on my laptop. And, um, well, should I say my Mac? I'm just going to press play. No, I'm just going to press play on that. I can't, really, should I say? Um, so it's the full screen experience. So it's just loading up, let it, you know, um, stream the video. So I'm just going to put it full screen. Um, my internet's kind of bad today. I don't know why. It's just kind of lagging my, my air play feature. Probably because the weather out there is kind of crap. So as you can see, it's full screen experience. I'm really sorry about this lagging. It's probably because of the bad weather. As you can see, it's just picked up now. It's all in HD as well, which is awesome. So I'm just going to go on um, YouTube. I'm just going to put my YouTube channel in. And go on my channel. So as you can see, full experience. So it's like it's basically like a web on your TV. Don't need a smart TV, just need a little Apple box and a Mac or you know. Um let's watch my latest video, Mario Kart 8 bundle. So I'm just gonna put that into zoom. So as you can see, nice colours, HD, everything looks marvelous. So I'm just gonna click out of this. I'm going to do something for the UK viewers out there, for ITV, uh, ITV player is it? I'm not quite sure, let's Google it. So I'm just going to show you full experience so you can watch all your you know, latest programs or TV shows, I don't know what you missed. Um, for you people who have not got a Netflix and you think Apple TV's just got Netflix, you could do this, put your uh, Mac in and just put I Love Films. It does work with Windows computers as well. So it's not just Mac, it does work with Windows, which is awesome for uh, Microsoft owners. 
out there. So this is, I'm not, I love film, I'm not actually subscribed to him, but as you can see, full screen experience, I don't know how this works, 30D guarantee, works on, you know, so I'm not really um, basically subscribed to these, I'm subscribed to Netflix as you pro probably know. Um, but yeah, that's how to get your um, Apple TV to run the full ex full web experience on with no uh, black bezel around your edge of your TV. But like I says, if you've got a 50 inch or a bigger screen than me, then please um, put in the comments if it works. If you've got any problems or you need help doing it, please let me know. Um, subscribe to my channel, Lose Tech One Page, and if you've got any issues or you need help with any Apple products or anything like that, please let me know. I'll be sure to try and help you with the questions. So thanks for watching.